Hello, this is Brett from Survival Comps. Recently I did some testing of the Baofeng Mini, and as part of the test, of course, I swept the antenna with my equipment. Now, in doing so, I showed the sweep and I said that there was some concern that I had because the antenna didn't behave like a shortened helical antenna, which is what you would normally expect from seeing something of this package size, etc. And the antenna itself physically pairs well with the radio, but the performance of the antenna is rather poor. So let's do some further testing of this antenna and competing against it is this small helical antenna that I made out of a few dollars worth of parts in about a half hour. So we will start with sweeps of our antennas under test and here's the factory antenna from the Mini. And it looks great when one looks at batch alone. The bandwidth of the antenna is far too broad for a shortened antenna in this measurement and the real world performance has been poor in my opinion. Here is the sweep of the antenna I built in my lab. And this is the kind of sweep you would expect in a shortened helical antenna. Now let's move to transmit testing of the Baofeng antenna. And we have a measurement of minus 83.34 decibel milliwatts per square meter. Here are the results of the antenna I constructed. And the measurement is minus 76.31 decibel milliwatts per square meter. In this case, my antenna exhibits a gain of 7 dB over the Baofeng antenna. Now we move to receive testing, and we now have our antennas under test connected to the spectrum analyzer receiving a locally generated low power carrier 50 yards away. The Baofeng antenna is giving us a signal of minus 80.35 decibel milliwatts. My antenna is giving us a signal of minus 74.39 decibel milliwatts, which is exhibiting a gain of 6 dB over the Baofeng antenna. So this reinforces my observation that the short antenna provided with the Baofeng Mini is subpar in performance outside of what one would expect from another shortened antenna example, especially one constructed of 20 gauge insulated shot firing wire wound around scrap air brake tubing soldered to a board mount SMA female and covered in glue lined heat shrink. It's a shame as the Baofeng Mini is a decent radio for the price and having to incur the additional expense of antenna procurement torpedoes the savings. Good antennas are free energy in a two-way radio application. So I'm interested in your feedback. If you have elected to use another antenna with the Baofeng Mini, what are you using that is of an equal form factor? I hope this helps. This is Brett from Survival Comms. Until next time.